I couldn't leave well enough alone. Couldn't. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. I couldn't leave this game alone, could I? No, I couldn't leave this level alone. No. I have to finish it. Or at least show you guys what to do a little bit more. I felt like I should have showed you guys more. So this is just going to be a two-parter Holofest. Which is fine. I mean, I think the last one was. What was it on? Dark Watch? Smash. Just to let you guys know, I did upgrade my guy a little bit. He's like level... Soul level 120 now. Holy. And also, I equipped it... This thing right here, which increases... Lowers magical power, but ra rises... Raises uh, magical defense, which will be pretty useful in this level, because this is a very magic-oriented level, and you guys know how much I hate magic. There's somewhere we have to go some at some point in this level, I think. I'm gonna put on warding just in case. This place is still locked. Singing again. Someone is not being nice. I think someone needs a timeout. I didn't. I barely even hit him too. It was just like a wham. It's over. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, there's a hole right there. Enemy's poison. Okay, I remember this. Yeah, let me tilt. Oh boy. He knows I'm there. So we're gonna kill him. Okay. Okay, now I think that's all we need in order to get through this part of the level, so we can go back. There's stuff around here, though. And then there's this thing, which I don't really want to open, because I might get scared and cry. But, uh, next we just go over here. Singing. Did I ever tell you guys what that was? That's the merchant. We'll get to see her in a minute. Hold on. This calls for some healing. Hello, fresh spice. Wait a second. I already have that equipped. I've got, like, I had, like, 30 of them, and my magic's not even that big to begin with, so. I did, I also got two, uh, full moon grasses, but. Okay, that opens. Uh, oh my gosh, you cannot have come at a worse time. Didn't even notice me either. When playing New Game Plus, it's always a good idea to have warding on. Even if your guy is super strong. Hey! Dummy! First spice. If, you, if you're if you the kind of person who likes to grind for items, this is a good place to grind for magical items. I didn't mean to touch that. How did this guy die? Uh oh. What a dummy. I'll show you guys Mr. S Miss Scary. Hey! Okay, I'll leave him alone. She's over here, by the way. Whoa. Is that necessary, sir? Hi, you can't... Hi, you missed me. Let's kill all the unnecessary people who are around here. There's no one unnecessary, surprisingly. Oh, she's over there. Let's talk to her. Here she is. You're an ordinary human, aren't you? Where do you call home? Oh, dear me, I shouldn't pry. Oh, perhaps you'd like something from my collection. I've had better days. 
I was once the wife of royalty. And I have some nice things to Yes, you do. You're a very nice lady. <coughs> she has all this. She's got a bunch of cool stuff. She's got that. A rapier if you really like to collect weapons. That. But she's got this. The Ring of Avarice. Which, you, which if, when you equip it, it'll give you more souls when you kill enemies. Well, that's... I wish... <coughs> I think pitfalls around here. If you press on, you can proceed. Oh, you're real funny. Ha, he missed. That squid guy's really, really bad, isn't he? Come here. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Whoa. Hey. I'm trying to get him to come over here so I can kill him. Hello! If I can ki Uh oh. This might be the end. Thankfully, I might survive. It's moments like this which make the game very, very unforgiving. First spice. Let's continue onward. Obviously, the way we went was not the right way. Is there a pitfall here? I think that's the only pitfall that is actually, like, not off at an edge. I think for the rest of the uh, game, it's like a... Uh... I don't know where Sage Frick, it, Frick is, but he's pretty useful if you want dark magic. Of course, he is the one who, at the end of the game, tells you to kill the Black Maiden, so... thought about killing him, decided against it, because I am not a murderer of people who work with me. We're getting to a point where we're getting to the area where this game, this is just another section of the place you don't necessarily need to go through here, I don't think. It's down here, which is kind of important. <clears throat> Open this up. Not only is there a key right there, but also you can go over there. It's the, This game's weird. There are like two different ways you can go through. You can either go in here, and then there'll be a, uh, <clears throat> a door you can go through, which will let you bypass something in particular that you may already know about. Or you can go through here where you just fight a big, mean, nasty guy. Unfortunately, I didn't bring any magic with me. But as you can tell, this place is to go. Place to go, at least. Go over here. Oh. Heavy crossbow. That actually might be useful. I'm not real good with a crossbow, though. But you go down here. <clears throat> and, uh, go over here. Or you can. You open this up. And, if I'm not mistaken, this place is... Yeah. There's someone mean over there. He shoots a giant ray of evil. I don't think my guy's strong enough to... That's not even that tough at all. I'll see if I can kill him. Ouch. However, there is a way you can get through there without having to do that. And normally, I, you know what? Let's just try it. Let's try getting through this guy. He's not that tough.
bringing out the northern regalia. Let's try attacking him head on. Uh oh. Well, that was a problem. I died. I'll be honest. After seeing that mean guy and. Oh, someone's on. Seeing that guy made me kind of angry, not gonna lie. He's a very frustrating dude to have. Dude, dude poo poo, diarrhea, dickwad. I'm gonna call it quits for today. I'll show you guys a quick level, maybe. Another scary level. Let's see if I can find one. Uh, this level does have a scary, and you already saw this. That uh, that level's kind of scary. There are not really any necessary scary, scary, scary levels. This level is evil. That level's evil. This level is probably the best level you could go to because of the whole soul grinding thing, or soul far. I keep wanting to say soul grinding, but it's really soul farming. And this, I'll be honest. This might be Project Dark. I mean, seriously, look. And that thing is still there. Why would they include that in there? Is it just for, like, decoration? Or are they, are they trying to hint at something? So pissed! I could, beat up, I could beat up patches. Of course, everyone wants to beat up patches. Uh, Not really much I can show you, honestly. So I think I'm going to cut this one short here. I did show you guys a good bit of the level. Like I said, if you go if you go to the level, there are technically two ways to get through that place. The regular way, just by going through and killing that big guy, it's gonna trigger a uh, arrow thing, and then that'll hurt you. And there's a way you can dodge that by timing your roll. And I did, and Trans Angel and I were witness to see that. We did see it ha happen. So it is able. You are able to do it, but I wouldn't advise it. You just go over there, then you turn it off, then you go into the temple, kill the Black Phantom. Then there's some more cryptic stuff. Maybe I'll go into this level again next time. But yeah, this is Flamzeron, aka YouTube's Tosse, signing out. See you later.